Hello everyone, uh, my name is Karoj Magali Ilan. Um, I started learning Irish many years ago uh, in bits and pieces, I might add. Um, my interest was sparked by listening to the songs of Clonet and Albert Fry, um, Nancy Vila Store, Duleman, uh, Obana Tikin, Watch Your Not. I remember that very well. Brilliant songs, and I hadn't clear what they were singing about, so I thought I'd remedy that and maybe learn something. Um, I'm currently attending classes um, nearly every Thursday evening um, at the Art Rang um, in the Amakwaha, which is a beautiful new building there in Armagh, I'm sure you're all aware of. Um, I find the people there, especially the teachers, give me a lot of confidence and encouragement and support in my learning there and um, I'm really enjoying it at the moment. It's a bit of a challenge but if it's not a challenge there's no point in doing it. Cracks night day. I try my best to get to the Gale Talk um, once a year in the summer and sometimes in October, uh, a weekend in October where Edge of Scale are running um, workshops and, and music for tin whistle and flute um, Askilga through Irish um, so it's great to meet people from all over the world there and to meet up again in the evenings in the in the local pub to play sing dance and drink and have great crack so where else would you be only Glen Colm Kill supposed to me the best thing about learning Irish um, as an adult is well I'm ready um, it's not the same as it was when I was at school. Um, there's no pressure. I'm a lot more comfortable in my skin, even though I have dyslexia and have trouble reading and writing. Um, and I feel I'm growing uh, in many ways uh, as a result of the Irish language uh, and the people I've met around me. That's great, I wish I'd been doing it years ago. You know, it wasn't really that long ago that uh, you wouldn't have heard a spoken word of English throughout the Ireland of Ireland, throughout the Ireland of Ireland. Um, I think it's important to have our, our language to understand our poet, our poets, our songs, our culture, our history, and I feel like we're really all inextricably linked: the language, uh, our ancestors, ourselves, inextricably linked together. Currently I'm not working. I used to be a, a mental health counsellor and a trauma specialist, a part-time lecturer in colleges in Uri and working in Belfast. Um, I find now that really I'm freed up and I love, I think for me too, uh, especially as uh, an adult and an older person learning the language, I have more opportunity to meet new people and to form new relationships and new pastimes. And life's good at the moment. Um, so I'm looking forward to more in the next story and the next adventure with Ian McWaha and indeed the Gale Talk when they reopen. There are many rich phrases and words in the Irish language and a phrase we got recently from one of our teachers, Sean O'Farry, was Huime Shir or Wohorin Nasminsha. Loosely translated, I went back down the roads of my thoughts and memories. Beautiful for this, reminiscing, something I'm doing a lot lately.